So the rattlesnake vaccine is just like any other core vaccine that your pet usually gets. It just makes the body stimulate antibodies against that rattlesnake venom and decrease the severity of their signs if they were exposed to a rattlesnake bite. And it gives you time to get them to a veterinarian. I would still recommend bringing them in for evaluation just to make sure that we're not missing any tissue necrosis. We can also probably give some antibiotics to prevent further infection from the bite itself. So the first sign you would see would be painfulness, especially at the bite site. You may also see two puncture wounds where the snake bit the dog. And if left long enough, you can start to see discoloration of that skin turning grayish black, and that's called tissue necrosis, where that tissue is dying off. Another sign you can see would be either paralysis, neurologic signs such as ataxia, which is difficulty walking, so we recommend two doses 30 days apart before your trip outdoors or, or hiking, traveling with your pet. That gives the body time to build up the immunity against the venom. And then it also gives us an idea as to whether we have side effects from the vaccine, which usually are mild flu-like symptoms. So the vaccine is safe for any dog over four months of age. We usually recommend it for those who go hiking a lot or go for long walks in their neighborhood, anywhere where you can tend to see rattlesnakes, especially here in Las Vegas. I would say they're pretty common, especially in environments such as Las Vegas, where we have the desert terrain, where rattlesnakes are known to be very present. Um, and even in your general neighborhood, there's still a risk that there's rattlesnakes hidden there. So I would still be cautious even just walking them around. Mm -hmm. 